A pleasant day to everyone. Today, we're going to test your general knowledge about the IUCN conservation status and distribution of some species. So let's get started. Number 51. Which of the following species is IUCN endangered? A. Buhadsha marmorata B. Stichophus horrens C. Holothoria atra and D. Holothoria scabra Can you guess the answer? If not, here are the pictures. A. Buhadsha marmorata B. Stichophus horrens C. Holothoria atra and D. Holothoria scabra Can you now guess the answer? If not, here is another hint. This species is also called sunfish, cortido, and kagisan. If your answer is D or Holothoria scabra, you're correct. Holothoria scabra has been classified by IUCN as endangered species. Number 52. Which species is endangered? A. Selenota ananas, B. Holothoria foscagilva, C. Holothoria idulis, and D. Holothoria foscopunctata. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the photos. A. Selenota ananas, B. Holothoria foscagilva, C. Holothoria idulis, and D. Holothoria foscopunctata. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This species has large lateral protrusions. If your answer is B or Holothoria foscogilva, you're correct. Holothoria foscogilva has been classified by IUCN as endangered species. Number 53. All species are listed in IUCN except A. Bergus latro, B. Holothoria foscogilva, C. Holothoria idulis, and D. Rhydacna gigas. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Bergus latro, B. Holothoria foscogilva, C. Holothoria idolis, and D. Tridacna gigas. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This species is also called burnt hot dog. If your answer is C or Holothoria idolis, you're correct. Holothoria idolis is not listed in the IUCN. Number 54. This species is of least concern in the IUCN. A. Conus marmoreus, B. Conus geographus, C. Haliotis asinina, and D. All of the above. Can you guess the answer? If not, here are the pictures. A. Conus marmoreus, B. Conus geographus, and C. Haliotis asinina. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This question has multiple answers. If your answer is D or all of the above, you're correct. All of these species are of least concern in the IUCN. Number 55. All species are Philippine protected except A. Charonia tritonis, B. Cassis cornuta, C. Rochea nilotica, and D. Telescopium telescopium. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Charonia tritonis, B. Cassis cornuta, C. Rochea nilotica, and D. Telescopium telescopium. Can you now guess the species? If not, here is another hint. This species is considered as noisance in brackish water fish ponds. If your answer is D or Telescopium Telescopium, you're correct. Telescopium Telescopium is not a protected species. Number 56. This species is not found in the Philippines. A. Tridacna gigas B. Tridacna derasa C. Tridacna maxima and D. Tridacna squamosina Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Tridacna gigas B. Tridacna de Rasa, C. Tridacna Maxima, and D. Tridacna Squamosina. Can you now guess the species? If not, here is another hint. This species has only been recorded in the Red Sea. If your answer is D or Tridacna Squamosina, you're correct. Tridacna Squamosina does not naturally occur in the Philippines. Number 57. 
This giant clam species has the widest distribution range. A. Tridacna crocea, B. Tridacna maxima, C. Tridacna squamosa, and D. Hippopus hippopus. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Tridacna crocea, B. Tridacna maxima, C. Tridacna squamosa, and D. Hippopus hippopus. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. In their natural habitats, the shell of these species is partly embedded on rock substrate, and uh, they are widely distributed in the Indo-Pacific Ocean. If your answer is B or Tridacna maxima, you're correct. Tridacna maxima has the widest distribution range among the known giant clam species. Number 58. Among the four giant clam species listed here, which one has the most limited distribution range? A. Tridacna de Rasa, B. Tridacna gigas, C. Hippopus porcelanus, and D. Tridacna rosewateri. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Tridacna de Rasa, B. Tridacna gigas, C. Hippopus porcelanus, and D. Tridacna rosewateri. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This species has only been recorded in Saya de Malha Bank, Indian Ocean. If your answer is D or Tridacna rosewateri, you are correct. Tridacna rosewateri has the least distribution range compared to the three other species. Number 59. This species is not found in the Philippines. A. Conus gloria maris, B. Tridacna balabuana, C. Tridacna Norway, and D. Conus marmoreus. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the pictures. A. Conus gloria maris, B. Tridacna balabuana, C. Tridacna Norway, and D. Conus marmoreus. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This species is formerly called Tridacna tevoroa. This species has been reported to occur in Western Central Pacific. If your answer is B or Tridacna balabuana, you are correct. Tridacna balabuana does not naturally occur in the Philippines. Number 60 or the last number. This giant clown species has the most limited distribution in the Philippines. A. Tridacna crocea, B. Hippopus hippopus, C. Hippopus porcelanus, and D. Tridacna de rasa. Can you guess the species? If not, here are the photos. A. Tridacna crocea, B. Hippopus hippopus, C. Hippopus porcelanus, and D. Tridacna de rasa. Can you now guess the species? If not, here's another hint. This species has white tentacles around the incarnate siphon. If your answer is C or Hippopus porcelanus, you're correct. Hippopus porcelanus has only been reported in Palawan and southern Mindanao. Outside the Philippines, Hippopus porcelanus only occur in Sabah, Malaysia, Palau, and Indonesia. That's all for now. If you have some questions or suggestions, Please write this down on the comment section below. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and feel free to share these three networks. See you soon!